So the first point I want to make is the fact that the operator on the top is mute from Rainbow Six Siege and the one on the bottom is silent. They're both masked operators that specialize in placing jammers that look like routers that block enemy UAVs and other equipment. Anything similar? The agent on the top is Pitfire from AF2. The agent on the bottom is Tachanka from Able Six Siege. They're both operators that deploy a mounted LMG that fires a lot of bullets and are also using a Spetsnaz helmet such as the one in PUBG Mobile. The operator on the left is Glass from Able Six Siege. The operator on the right is Hawkeye from RAF2. They both have a similar icon showcasing a sniper scope icon and they also have a sniper scope that can fold onto a QBU that can see through smoke and highlight enemies. I sure wonder why this game got sued, am I right? Oh yeah, but how could I forget that Glass and Hawkeye are literally the same in terms of appearance. They're both wearing headsets and a mask covering their face and they also are holding a QBU up to their chest. In the top left we have Wolf from IF2, in the bottom right we have Capcan from Able Six Siege. Both of their abilities are placing laser bombs that trigger upon motion and automatically kill anybody who is near them. And as if that wasn't enough, they literally have the same clothing. Both of them are wearing a scarf that is covering their face. I mean, what else could you want? Google is very creative and it's also against copyright infringement, am I right? Am I right? But the reason why I mentioned the character's appearance and clothing so much is because in page 13 of the lawsuit, it is mentioned that the characters found in IF2 are very similar in design to the ones found in Rainbow Six Siege. And therefore, it's another example of why I have to copy the Rainbow Six Siege.